So beneath this uh, plastic, there is a 16 inch Dobsonian Explore Scientific Telescope. Yep. On a weekday afternoon, me and my friend Urban set off to hunt deep sky objects at a dark sky site 70 kilometers away. We were going to use his huge Dobsonian telescope. And I wanted also to take advantage of the dark skies for some wide angle photography. Everything a, a man or woman needs. So what are you doing? Uh, Locking yes. the truss tubes, yes. perhaps? Yeah, those bolts that often drop off by themselves if they have the opportunity. So. So. Now they're held in place. So this one will go on this side, I presume. Here comes the secondary. Uh, and now the secondary will be a critical moment. And this is an awful moment. If I didn't hold the camera, I would give you a helping hand. I see. Mm. Now it becomes a bit exciting to see if he will manage. I think the fear of dropping it is over. Hmm? Collimation screw. The dot is there. Yeah, this is kind of a unique thing for this Explore Scientific. Yeah, yes, you can stand here and yeah. do the work. Look at the same time as yeah. your. So you can uh, collimate by yourself without help from yeah. another one. By the way, look at this big nice mirror. Read the dust free also. Yeah, including the dust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's not much. And a huge secondary mirror. Yeah, yeah. So soon we will be better collimated than the James Webb telescope. Hopefully. <laughs> In between the visual, visual observing I have been doing some wide field photography also. Shooting the Orion part of the sky and the Big Dipper part. Together with some nice foreground on my trusty Sky Watcher Star Adventure.
Yeah, and now we finished after three hours or something. Finished three hours, the yes. I think it was cold. <laughs> yeah, it's starting to get no, no, cold. It's I, I, it's, nice. uh, yeah, one of the warmest nights actually I've been yes, out. Yes. First time not freezing my feet off. No, no, <laughs> actually the feet are no problem. Yeah. <laughs> it's usually there is the feet that decide to go home. Yeah. I think we looked at a lot of galaxies and nebulas and yes, absolutely. And I think uh, the main, the, the most interesting thing, it was the NGC 3628. Yeah. First time I see the dark lines in it. Yeah. Quite nice. Yeah, and it's a really good telescope. This uh, yeah. both gathers a lot of light and it's also yeah. very sharp. Absolutely, and and it's. Uh, it should be more popular because it's quite easy to handle also and put together. It's quite you saw when I put up this. Yeah. It took it took not no more than my my C8 setup actually. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm amazed at how quick it goes and this uh, uh, collimation thing that you have so you can collimate yeah, from yeah. from because the uh, eyepiece. From the front. Yeah. You can yeah. sit sit there and look at the eyepiece and say okay. It's quite an easy, quite an easy and smart collimation tool they have invented. This Explore Scientific. Yeah, and it's uh, it is easy to steer and control also, yes. Yes. and moving small amounts is really yes. easy. No, no problem. And uh, another thing I think is very nice with this one is you don't need any kind of balance stuff or anything. I, just the friction is a little bit stiff up and down, but on the other hand, it doesn't move. Yeah. You can. And that's better. <laughs> that's better, better that it doesn't move when yes. you don't want it to. And also, if you see, I have a lot of uh, right angle finder scope and also a red dot finder. But tonight the battery was off the red dot finder, so I just use it as a rough guide scope. Yeah. And well, it, I think it works. Yeah, I think that's a good uh, start with the rough guider scope and then to the right angle yeah. finder and then to a to, low yeah. power yeah, eyepiece. Yeah. And I think the, low, the right angle find is actually the, the secret because then you can compare with the map directly Yeah. and see that, okay, I move, I should move down and to the left and that's down to the left in the finder yeah. scope also. And you have uh, made your own uh, yeah. shroud here yeah, too. Yeah, 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 it was quite easy. <laughs> It's a just a rough one, yeah. more or less to, to avoid, to protect the mirror from, from falling stuff from the trees. Yeah, <laughs> and it uh, protects from stray light also. Yeah, a, a little. Yeah. <laughs> it's good enough. Yeah. I think we have to go home now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're starting to freeze anyway and we have a long ride home. Absolutely.